All right, so I'm on Imperial because there was like literally like nothing coming in on two four left. So wait, no, two four right, <laughs> two four right. So yeah, here comes an H three thirty. You can hear the engine howl. It sounds freaking awesome, but the camera probably can't hear it because it's pretty loud right here. Yeah, and I freaking got out the car. Like I I I literally like like almost never do that. I do do it sometimes, but I never get on uh, um, the car on on this uh, on Imperial. I haven't done, haven't got out the car on Imperial in a long time, and I could actually see more stuff. A China Airlines triple seven came in like about an hour ago. Gotta sound like the RB211. Sounds like the RB211. One of the best engines like ever made. Literally. I'm I'm not joking, like that's my favorite engine of all time. But <laughs> so yeah, that that is that was an A330. Same livery as it was um um on 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 uh, Wednesday, um, when they were using their first pattern, um, same liveries, three times in a row, three times in a row, we got the same China Southern livery. Wait, no, <laughs> China so China Eastern livery. Three times in a row is double Korean Airlines. When we well back when there were um, finer A three eighties, we wouldn't get um, double Koreans. We would only get double um, Korean Air cargos, not um, double um, Korean Air passenger planes. Yeah, but now we get double Koreans. It feels so weird standing right here because I haven't like st I, I haven't um I haven't st I, I think I hear a 747 pushing out but um like, it feels so weird standing right here because I haven't not like gotten out the car in a while on this side so yeah but like it feels really weird I'm getting out like I haven't like I haven't gotten out um in a while so it feels really weird standing right here there's a knee. Oh, I thought that was a Neo. <laughs> there's a, there's a uh, A321. Freaking firework for some reason. It's, it's, it, it's freaking, it's the, it's freaking February. It's February. Oh my God. It's, it's the one year anniversary of, of my final time seeing a um, British 747. Actually, it wasn't my final time. It's like my, my first final time seeing a. British 747 before they um before they grounded them and retired them, like that was like like, like about, a, about 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 half a month before they retired them. And no, not retired, not retired. Um, um, grounded them. So, yeah. Yeah, there's a new airline called um, Avatar, and um, they are an American airline. They're American airline, and they are gonna operate a fleet of 747s passengers so yeah i'm excited and plus they're, they're they're trying to get some of british's um 747s so yeah so british so if that happens british 747s aren't going to be all gone they're still going to be fine but they're not going to be called british airways 747s because they're going to be flying with avatar airways and holy crap i talked really fast without like immediately stuttering uncontrollably holy crap <laughs> so yeah <laughs> that's really exciting because I cannot wait. So, so like, like if that happens, like I cannot wait to hear those RB two elevens roaring again. Because yeah, that because that because I love RB two elevens. Like it's my favorite engine. Like the seven forty seven um, RB two eleven versions, best ones. Seven fifty seven RB two elevens, like the one right here. They're they're they're, they're fine. They sound pretty good, but nothing beats the. Uh, the 747 RB211 variant. 
because like it has like the best buzzsaw ever. Like, there's this video of of someone on a uh, on a on a uh, uh, I was going to say Boac um, on a on a British 747. The 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 the, the buzzsaw is like awesome. It, it it it's like the best buzzsaw ever. And you can literally just type in like like there's any video is gonna be awesome. Um, just type in um, British 747 takeoff. It'll come right up. And whoa, private jet. <laughs> I'm talking about British 747s a lot lately. <laughs> Probably because it's so freaking awesome. Vegas, I think that's the Las Vegas um, um, private airline that has the 747 SP, and I think they still have an R, uh, no, not RP211, um, um, L211. So, yeah, hopefully um, they fly their, their, their L211 here because I've never seen an L211 before, and, they, and the L211 is freaking dead. <laughs> yeah, I hope one day an airline um, gets like one of the last. Um, um, Elton 11s ever um, and, and, and flies them and if um, an airline or, or private airline or whatever like whoever has the last Elton 11 when you when you guys retire them please fly them like every single place um, ever like, like like it's flown to and please fly it to LAX because I've never seen that Elton 11 and I really I don't want to um, have to fly like halfway across the freaking the freaking country to see an L211, and plus, they're but if, like, I'm not even going to be able to do that because um, one, we don't even have plane tickets. Two, we're in the middle of a freaking pandemic. But yeah, so yeah, yeah. I I I I like like I've always wanted to see an L211, especially the passenger variant if they still have the passenger variants so got and my freaking phone is oh yeah by the way um the the, the they, 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 yes there is a freaking um, um freighter variant but I think the freighter variant like died like years ago so uh, that sucks but yeah yeah like half of like oh yeah oh yeah here's something I forgot to say right here November, I think it was like the 27th, November, 2019, I saw, like, this is like one of the, one of the best days of, of, of my life, <laughs> so yeah, it's like, I saw in that gate, um, um, with the Korean Airlines, it doesn't have its um, logo light on, um, a BOAC 747. Best day of my life. I was so excited. I've never seen their retro liveries. I thought it was like actually Boac until I learned that Boac doesn't exist anymore. And it's just a retro. But, well, it was still awesome. And I thought it was like, 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 like Boac. Like actually Boac. And, like, seriously. I remember it just coming down the runway. And I was like, literally so excited. It was just coming down the runway. And had the best buzzsaw ever. Like literally ever. Best buzzsaw ever. And somehow and British like flew like about like three to five seven forty sevens here a day. And somehow I never got video of one landing. Uh, um like, and somehow I never got video of one landing. Actually I did get video of one landing. It was one world. I got double um British 747s landing. It was one world and regular livery. And 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 like I was over there. That was my first time on the bridge. I was over there on the bridge over there where I saw the A380. Um, that one time in August. Um, and double British Airways. And the video I forgot to upload it. And then the phone that I recorded the video on broke. So yeah, I forgot to upload it. And and now it's lost forever. <laughs> now it's lost forever. And now it's nothing but a memory. A good memory that I wish I would have uploaded. <laughs> because that, because, like, like, <laughs> like, 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 it's not every day, like, especially now, um, it's not every day you get to see two double British Airways 747s. <laughs> I, I ate a bunch of candy, so yeah, I'm like, like, really hyped right now. 
<laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. My storage is about to die right 